Atlanta Braves designated hitter Marcelo Zuna had one of the weirder starts to a season one can have. In his first nine games of the season, Ozuna got two hits. Just two hits and 33 plate appearances and a .071 batting average. But here's the catch. Both of Ozuna's two hits were home runs. He was absolutely terrible overall in the month of April, hitting to a batting average under 100 and had just five hits overall. And it's not like Ozuna can play any defense. His literal only job on the team is to hit. He was failing miserably to do that other than an occasional home run. Braves fans were starting to turn on him and boo him. Herrera swing and a miss. Inside and down goes Ozuna. Swing and a miss, and Ozuna's done. It was pretty ugly. But then May arrived, and a switch flipped on, because Marcelo Ozuna has been one of the best hitters in all of baseball since May began. From his first game in May, May 2nd, all the way through June 3rd, Marcelo Ozuna hit to a 309 batting average with an OPS over 1,000 slugging nine home runs and three doubles. So after the abysmal start, he has been awesome for the Braves as the DH and finally seems to be back to what he was in his first year in Atlanta back in 2020. In his first at bat on Sunday afternoon against the Diamondbacks in Arizona, Ozuna would work a walk. And in his second at bat in the fourth inning, he'd end up on first base yet again, except there was just one big massive issue. If you're part of the 70% not subscribed watching this video, make sure to hit that button, thank you. He should have been on at least second base easily. During that second at bat, Ozuna absolutely demolished a pitch, sending it 415 feet deep to center field and he watched it, expecting it to be a home run. So much so that when the ball ended up going off the wall, Ozuna hadn't even hit first base yet because he was staring and showboating his hit. So Marcelo Ozuna's strange year continues despite his hitting doing much better now with him hitting a 415 foot single 415 feet just to end up on first base that's a problem obviously this is like the best and most perfect example you'd ever find of a player not hustling when he should be hitting a ball that high and that far should not result in a single that just cannot happen and i feel like braves manager brian snitker just had to pull zuna for everyone's sake if a manager is ever going to pull his player for not hustling again this is the most perfect example of that you can possibly find Ozuna just handed that to his manager. I mean, come on. So Snicker went on to replace Ozuna's spot in the lineup with catcher Sean Murphy for the rest of the game, a game in which the Braves won. So in the end, none of this really mattered for them, but still not a good luck for Ozuna. After the game, according to the Associated Press, manager Snicker said that he guarantees Ozuna feels worse than he himself does for having to take him out. And again, I wouldn't even think Snitker was that mad. I think it was one of those situations where Ozuna was just asking to be taken out. Not literally, but because of what he did. You just can't stay in the game after that. That'd be a bad look for the Braves. But, oh well, I'm sure he learned his lesson, and hopefully that's the last 400-plus foot single in Marcelo Ozuna's career. Can't have that happening. Let me know what you think. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.